Hello YouTube again. This is my second attempt to make a Nokia Lumia 610 review. I just got this phone and I got it under contract. Uh, to start with, well, this is a, a white model. You get uh, four different colors. You get black, you get blue, you get magenta, and obviously white. This is the box that it came with. It's a very small box and it comes with only the basics. Uh, you can slide it off like this. It's very well organized. They're using, I want to dare say that they're using a recycled cardboard. And um, this is a good thing. I love the fact they're using recycled things. Uh, you get, well, obviously here was your phone. And you get all of your um, information. All of the papers come in this little box. And this is my ticket. And this last three div uh, divisions is where all this little goodies come with. Now they come with only your connector or your charger. They come with the USB cable, which is now longer as they used to be, and your headset. Now, this is probably the first difference that you will find from other Nokia telephones. Do you remember your old body, this charger? Remember that they used to be the same entrance for every telephone, right? No long, no more. Um, this is bye bye. No more with this charger. You get this charger and your USB cable. So you can use the USB cable both for uh, data transfer or to connect it and charge your phone. You can whether uh, connect it to your uh, to your connector or you can just connect it directly to your computer and your telephone will start charging. It doesn't matter if your computer doesn't recognize the telephone. It will still charge it on. Uh, this is also a good thing and since you got rid of this old charger you're also helping the environment because they're producing less plastic and well your hands free and your earplugs are nothing out of this world they're just earplugs with your 3 channel and your 3.5 millimeter entrance and you will see that your telephone will only have the data transfer entrance and a 3.5 millimeter entrance so that's about it from this phone and those are all the, go the goodies that you come that this telephone comes with. Uh, the telephone is very simple as you can see. It only has three buttons, uh, physical buttons, which are these ones. To start with, this is the camera button right over here. This is the lock and also the on and off button and this is the volume button. Uh, comparing to other Nokia telephones like this um, Express Music 5530, they have the same button so you won't be a stranger with the interface. You get your camera button, the lock, slide button and you get your volume button. The difference is that the on and off button is right on top and this one is on the lock button. So if you press it and you have to be very gentle, you don't need to be forcing things. And you get your first screen and you get the basic information like the hour and the date and some reminders and if you have any new email or new messages that you haven't read you will get it right on the bottom uh, you slide it up and you get your menu this is the first menu that you will find which is all different since this is a windows phone you will find a lot of differences to start with all of the components obviously are from microsoft uh the, well to start, you get your phone uh, interface right here. You get a history from all, all the things that you've done. You can use your telephone as, well, as a telephone. <laughs> and you get your contacts and you can search for in a specific contact. Your contacts here are now uh, all reunited in a hub that they have created. You can add your contacts uh, from, well, from other telephones like this one. You can add contacts from Facebook and Twitter and Windows Live and Google if you want to and they are all together in one single account if you have the same person in two different accounts you can link them together for example I have this guy right over here and I want to link him so I have this little chain icon I do it here and I can choose on which so I know that this guy is right this one so the, I link them all together in one single account uh, this is a very good thing because once you show one single account uh, or one single content, you will get his email, his phone number, his Twitter, and you can just decide what to do. You can whether send him an email to one of his accounts or you can send him another email to his uh, work email or you can just send him a tweet or whatever. You can choose and do it right on the same hub. This is a very useful and time-saving application. Uh, you get your SMS messages 
and you get your inbox from emails. You can link all of your accounts into one single inbox. This is also very time saving. Uh, I have only two email accounts here, but I get all of the mails here. Obviously, you can differentiate which one comes from which. Um, now, this telephone comes with Zoom. This is a Microsoft telephone. So you have to download Zoom to your PC so you can synchronize all of the contents from your telephone. Um, this is the time to speak about one of the disadvantages that I found on this telephone. Uh, unlike other Nokia telephones, which had a slot here and you can change your micro SD uh, memory, this one doesn't have a micro SD memory. It only comes with 8 gigabytes memory and you are gonna have to be next to your computer all the time so you'll be so you can uh, download and or upload any contents to your phone or from your phone so you can get free space. Uh, after you get all of your applications and get all of the things done, you're going to get about 6 gigabytes of free space uh, for both music and images. Uh, you get maps and with, with Nokia I get Nokia maps, I get Nokia driving and um, with my phone provider I get another GPS service. So this is very fast but it also depends on how your network is, um, is whether it's fast or not or whether you get a very good reception. In my case I'm in a very poor reception area so this has taken a little more but it gets your location right away. It pins you right down so it's always good in case you get lost. Uh, you get WhatsApp. It doesn't come with your telephone, but you have to download it from WhatsApp.com or whether you can go to Marketplace and get it for free. Uh, it comes obviously with Internet Explorer, which is the worst browser in history. I haven't tried it on the telephone, but I really don't trust it that much. You also get your entrance to Xbox Live. Uh, for all those Xbox users, you're going to find this very useful. Uh, you get four games. Um, which are demos, you get Asphalt 5, you get Angry Birds, Fruit Ninja, and Plants vs. Zombies. You get also uh, your avatar, you can personalize your avatar once you've already downloaded from the marketplace this Xbox Live Extras and you get your avatar there, it's completely animated and you can just change it, you can change the appearance day by day depending on how you want it to be and you get all of your um, I don't have any friends because I don't have an Xbox, but you can get your friends and um, your collection and everything, you can just uh, just start managing it from here. Uh, the next thing will be, well, your calendar. Your calendar connects directly to every event you have on Facebook and you will get notifications on your calendar right away. You also get your images. Now, the camera from this telephone is a 5 megapixels camera. I like the images a lot and one of the things that I really like about this telephone is that you get all of your albums in one single hub. You can get your camera album I have nothing because I just recently got it, but also you get all of your albums from Facebook, from SkyDrive, and they are all together. Right once you link your telephone to your different social networks, everything comes right here, and you get uh, well all of your albums, both SkyDrive or Facebook or whatever else you've got another album. You can link it here, and you get your albums all together, and that's. Um, you can tag your photos again, you can write, upload it, you can uh, sharpen the image with just one single uh, button and then upload it to whether Facebook or Twitter or whatever you want to. You can download Twitter from Marketplace and Foursquare as well and you can pin or unpin any applications to your start menu. You get Mega Video for Windows Phone 7 and this last tile right over here will be like a well, it's, it's just about yourself and you get your profile and you can publish a message. You can publish it on Windows Live, Facebook, Twitter, or even Google if you want to. And if it starts getting longer, like over 140 characters, then Twitter just goes away because you can't post anything more. And if it's if it gets longer than 450 for Facebook, it also tells you you can't post it on, when, on Facebook or whatever. You can just establish your location and you can start a, a chat if you want to. You get all of your notifications again from Facebook, Twitter, or Windows Live or Google if you want to. And you get your timeline again from all of your social networks in one single timeline. And well, that's it. This is the first start menu and if you click this little arrow, you get all of your other apps. 
right here. Uh, the, some of them are very basic, like all Nokia telephones come with like your alarm, your calculator, and uh, help, and your camera. And the configuration from this telephone is a lot less than any other telephone. And you have to go to different uh, parts of the menu so you can configure it. This is very easy, very simple. Uh, although I sometimes get lost, but. It's, it's a very easy thing once you start uh, understanding it. You get uh, with ESPN, which I haven't tried it because I'm not into sports, and um, radio and games and maps and marketplace and all. The marketplace is very uh, is very good. Ever since I started with this uh, Windows phone, the marketplace started having a lot more apps, a lot more fun, and they are, they are very, very cheap. Uh, they're just as cheap as any, any Android or any iPhone application. Uh, it also comes with Office, obviously, and this is the contact sharing thing I, I I haven't tried it yet, but uh, if you have your old telephone with Bluetooth, you just synchronize this to those two telephones uh, by Bluetooth, and you can pass your contacts from your old telephone to your new telephone, so you don't have to be doing it manually. Um, the other three buttons that you get with your telephone will be this three buttons. You get your arrow, which is the back button. Um, if you want to see what you have done, you just press it, and you get to see all of the things that you were doing, like, like a list. Um, you get like every Windows telephone, you will get your start button. This is just like you will have it in a computer. You get your start button and it will take you directly to this start menu. And the last thing you get is this little uh, magnifying glass, which is a button that will take you directly to Bing. And uh, you can whether well, search anything with the search bar or you can use this little eye thingy right over here which is a QR scanner or uh, you can search for text. Once you open the, your QR scanner, like write this, you can uh, try to find any text. I have here some... is looking for text here and it's got all of the text right away. So you can just click on any text, for example, you got need and I translate and I get all of the languages that I can translate this word from or um, if I want to search for this word, it gets into the to the Bing service and it gets me all of these results from the word that I just searched. It's very quick and it's very good and it does the same with any QR code. So this is basically the telephone. It also uh, changes depending on whether you're holding it per, uh, horizontally or vertical, you can switch the image. I think this is a very good phone, it's very fast, it's uh, very versatile and as a smartphone, uh, as a communication device, this is very helpful. I get all of my communication needs solved in this single phone. Uh, so this is it, I like the phone, I hope you find this uh, well, this product review very uh, interesting and if you have any other questions I found another channel I'm gonna link uh, directly to my comments down below uh, I found it from phone arena arena and I think that uh, since they are tech experts you're gonna find your information even more useful I hope you like this and I'll see you next time bye bye